process antigen and display the fragment on the cell surface in association with the major histopo compatibility complex or MHCs. So what are uh, APCs? Examples of which are macrophages, B cells, and lipidic cells. So in this picture, you can see that this is a whole uh, antigen presenting cell. So as discussed earlier, um, the uh, antigen presenting cells has lysozymes that act on the antigens to make them as fragments, but it does not end, end there. They become, uh, they are endocyte, uh, they enter the vesicle and are presented into the surface of the APCs together with the major histocompacting AP complex 2. So that's the main function of your antigen presenting cell to display the antigen class 2 MHC on the cell surface. So, so if we say class 2 MHC, what is the B cell? 4 times 2. So class or M for class two MHC, so, so CD4, CD4 cells, so um, helper T cells. So uh, I'll just run through this. These are the T cells, their functions. So here, helper T cells are also known as CD4 T cells. They secrete cytokines, which are a group of proteins and peptides for signaling the compounds. So they also secrete, and they all also are in three, three types or two types: TH1 and TH2. Um, the, he the helper B cells require the, the receptors or the major histocompatibility complex 2 on the surfaces of the APCs so that they can recognize the antigen. You see, um, uh, B cells cannot recognize the free antigen unless they are they have receptors on the APCs. So in this picture, it summarizes of the web, the, the whole answer. So that's the APC. Once there, it recognizes the antigen. It, releases A, um, frag the fragments of which are expressed on the surface through class 2 MHC. It, um, it produces interleukin 1 which activates your T helper cell. T helper cell have two phases, TH1 and TH2. T helper cells also secrete interleukin 2. These interleukin 2 are growth factors for clonal expansion to become TH, intermediate TH cell, T helper cell, and become and differentiate into TH1 and TH2. The TH1 can become the T cytotoxic cells or can also become memory T cells and the TH2 can become B cell or memory B cells for humoral immunity and cell-related immunity. So in this picture, it's a better representation of how everything happens. So once there's a bacteria or an antigen, it is recognized by the macrophage, which is an antigen-presenting cell, the antigen presenting cell um, shows the, the uh, surface uh, shows the, the surface the receptors for Turning the macrophage and it is recognized by the helper T cell and and the rest goes on. So that's the pathway. Okay, very good. So all of this can be found.